Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here on this bright and early uh, morning, enjoying the sunshine and the birds and my coffee. I'm, I'm drinking my coffee this morning. So good. And I'm I'm going to start a new project this morning. It's going to be a draped flower pot. I've, I've decided to uh, try another draped flower pot. Uh, you, you get a cotton cloth and you fit it on a mold and you dip it in cement mixture, uh, sort of uh, watered down like not real thick and and you dip your cloth in, in this uh, mixture and then you drape it over a form and when it dries it takes the shape of this form that you put it over and I'm gonna try that today I I have made the, some before and everyone seemed to like them so I'm gonna try another one now and see how it turns out you know Everything I do don't turn out exactly the way I planned, but it turns out some way, so <laughs> I'm going to keep on trying anyway. Thank y'all so much for watching my videos. Have a blessed day. Subscribe and share. And now I'm going to get around here and mix up my cement, uh, Portland cement and Georgia sand. And that's my mixture that I use. And... I love the way it does, and I enjoy doing it. Thank y'all so much for subscribing and sharing to my channel. I'm so blessed and thankful for everyone. Thank you. Okay, here's my, my tub. I'm going to put my Portland cement. Six cups of Portland cement. I strained it so it doesn't have any lumps in it not supposed to okay six cups of Georgia sand of course it's just sand and six more cups is 12 so I'm gonna mix that up water this has got to be thin like so it can absorb the cloth that I put in here you don't want this real thick looks like what I need right here it's thin okay 
I'm going to let it sit here a minute. What I'm going to do is drape my cloth around and cut it. And it's just cotton or blanket material that that I had I've had a long time. I'll cut this in half. This is just loose woven uh, stuff that this is made out of, so it should absorb the moisture pretty good. And I'm going to cut it. the circle try to now I'm gonna do this one the same way no, I'm going to leave that one this away. Okay, let's start soaking up some cloth. this down in here and let it be absorbing.
my camera cut off a little bit ago, and I'm I'm trying to get my things on the bottom blend the way I want them. I don't want them all just flat down. I want them to be standing out a little. And I'm putting rocks or whatever I can find out here to make it lay out like I want it to. That's not enough. Let's see. Where's some rocks? I got plenty of rocks. But getting one the way I want it is another thing. I'm just trying everything I can find to put under there to make it do what I want it to. Okay, we're going to see how this turns out when it dries. Thank you all for watching this. Thank you. Have a blessed day. Good morning. I'm out here going to open up this take this out of the mold and see how it looks see if we need to do anything else to it or what but that's what we're about to do now it, it's supposed to rain today so I'm getting an early start so maybe I can get get this done before it rains we need it so bad thank y'all so much for watching this <laughs> have a blessed day thank you Okay. I'll put the mold if, if I can. Oh, this is when you need some help. <laughs> but you have to learn how to do it by yourself because help's not always around. some bags that I put in here. It's not quite firm as I want it, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put a little more cement on it and let that dry and see if that helps. Okay, some of my uh, ends here is not as firm as I would like so I'm going to put a little more cement on it and see if it'll firm up some I'm putting some more cement in this 
a bowl and it's uh, thick. I'm going to add some water with it so I can paint this cement a little thicker than it is. If something don't work out the way you want it to, just keep on trying until you get get it to work. You don't give up because it don't don't want to work. Just keep on trying. Something will happen that you can work it out. That's what life's all about. Just keep on trying when, when things try to get you down. Just try to keep on uh, going and not don't let don't let the, the devil take the joy out of your life because he surely will try to do that. This should dry and be okay now. It's just I don't think I had enough cement mixture on the lee, uh, outer uh, part here. It kind of didn't get soaked in good. But it can be fixed, so that's what I'm doing. I'm fixing it. Trying to. Just mix your cement up kind of thin where it's like, like paint a little bit. You just kind of dip your brush down in the uh, water and cement and just brush it on a little thicker. That should, I just had a lady to send me a picture of some she did and they were beautiful. need two or three more hands. <laughs> But we don't have that, so we just got to do with what we got and be thankful that we got them. And I am very thankful. This is going to be beautiful when it dries. I need Sometimes when things don't work out the first time, sometimes it it looks better uh, after you do it again than it did the first time. So what if this happens to this? <laughs> Wouldn't that be great?
This shouldn't take long to dry. I hope everyone had a great Mother's Day. I did. I I went to my son's and we cooked up there and I ate. It was very nice. Good morning. I'm out here this morning going to work on this draped pot that I started on a few days ago. And I thought it was dry, but it wasn't dry when I opened it up. So I took it around. I, I mixed up some more cement and I like painted it on and made it uh, harder and uh I'm going to paint it. I'm going to take it out of this bucket now and uh, paint it and see how it turns out. <laughs> uh, it's been very wet late, uh, lately. It looks like rain today, this morning. It looks like it may rain at any time. <laughs> so I may have to stop if it starts raining. But I'm going to work on it now and... See how it turns out. Thank y'all for watching this. Thank you so much. All right, let me get up. I'm going to paint it. I'm going to, oh, I might feel a drop of rain. I don't, oh, I hope it doesn't rain. Okay, well, I'm going to work on it, and then if I have to go in, I'll work on it later. Thank y'all. Okay, I'm going to take the middle part out if I can. Whenever I was, I had it around there painting on the leaves, I decided that I liked it. Kind of opened up like, uh, rather than just straight up and down. So I kind of let some of the leaves like lay back a little. I like that look. So it sort of looks like a flower. Oh, and I got a piece of plastic down there I got to get off that I tied the leaves up. That cement's sort of heavy, and it kind of doesn't want to stand up as well because it's got this heavy cement on it. some paint. Oh, I'll let you see the all the way around it.
Oh, I'm probably in the way. <laughs> oh. Okay. That's see it. Okay, now I'm going to get out my paint and start painting on it before the rain, if, if it's possible. Okay, I think I'm, I've got this paint, this kind of paint right here. It's Rust-Oleum American. It's got little flakes in it, like stick, and it kind of looks like stone, it says. But I'm going to uh, paint on it some now. Oh, and I got, I've got a mask I'm going to put on while I'm painting, so I won't breathe any uh, paint fumes. <laughs> Okay, let me get the paint open. I hope this does what I think it's going to do. Let me get my mask on. I'm going to hold it with one hand.
Okay, this is some more of that kind of paint, and it's a lighter shade. I'm going to do the edges with, with it. I see a place I didn't get. Get my mask. Got a lighter. I've got a lighter shade of the same kind of paint, and I'm gonna see if it makes any difference. It might, it might, and it might not. Putting my mask on. <laughs> Can y'all believe that my camera cut off while I was videoing and I didn't know it. And this part where I put my flowers in the pot and all wasn't on there and I was so upset about it. I said, well, I, I've just got to do that part over because I want everybody to see the pot and the flowers and everything that I did. I was so proud of it. It, it was kind of a big job uh, getting it together and all and I want to also give a shout out to my son Danny 
S. Hodges and Stephen Hodges, uh, my son and my grandson, uh, has a, a video channel, and uh, they, my son plays the drums, and he does videos. I would like for y'all to look at their channel, if you don't mind, and see how you like it. They're singing a, a beautiful song, and I want to uh, let people see it if they want to, uh, I want to let people look at, the, at their video, if you don't mind. <laughs> Thank you. And it's about to rain now, and I, I'm, I'm going to have to get in because it's just about to rain. It's kind of damp already. And I want to thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed, blessed day. Subscribe and share. And, oh, ring, ring the little, there's a little bell down there that you click on the little bell and you get notifications of when I put another video on you can see it and and you won't miss any <laughs> thank y'all so much and have a blessed day and thank you to my YouTube family thank you so much for making me part of your life thank you have a blessed day <laughs>